it's Aaliyah from Soap Cult. I'm doing a market next week and I am low-key freaking out. Thankfully, I have got incredible friends and they've just opened their homes and storage sheds up to me <laughs> so that I can just go through and pick a whole bunch of stuff that I can use as display items. So uh, yeah, blessed to have some very, very awesome people in my life. This is the stuff that I picked up on the weekend from two friends of mine. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, I'm obviously not going to need everything, but I'm just sort of stuck <laughs> with how I'm going to display everything. So it's handy to have a lot of options to choose from. So this is inside my warehouse. This is where I've got the you know mock uh, market display set up. That's how it's gonna look from the back. And yeah, basically I'm just going to unload all of this stuff uh, and put it inside the warehouse and then just play around <laughs> and see what I can do. Yeah, so there's quite a bit in these suitcases. There's tons and tons of books, you know, really, really beautiful old books um, that I'm thinking of stacking up or I might just use them for a photography shoot or something like that. Um, yeah, that cool bench there. It's actually meant to be a seat, but a friend of mine who does markets quite often, Beck, um, she actually puts it up on top of her table and then covers it with um, a tablecloth, a fitted tablecloth, and it just creates this awesome extra layer of height. Um, and she makes jewellery, so she has all of her jewellery stands, uh, you know, sort of like leaning up against them. It gives her, yeah, a lot of extra height. Um, I'll use it for something else. A friend of mine, Sandy, lent me these incredible uh, drawers. They're from an old Singer sewing machine. And they were her grandmother's and she salvaged them. Um, before the house was knocked down. <laughs> so I'm, um, yeah, so, so honored to be able to uh, borrow these. Um, yeah, so I think that's everything. God, I love this van. It's got sliding doors on both sides and then the barn doors at the back. It is very good, yes. Boy, so much stuff. Yep, it's locked. All right, come on in. Locked, locked, locked. Yeah, that chair's a problem. <laughs> it's broken. I don't know how I'm going to get rid of it, to be honest. I don't use the roller door too often. I normally come in through the front door, but when I've got stuff to unload, this is um, just the easiest. So this is a gorgeous cloche. I think that's how you pronounce them, cloche. I, I honestly never know. Let's put some lights on so we can actually see. And yeah, now I decided to take you on a tour of the warehouse. So this is some soap that is uh, cured and ready to go and curing and also, you know, just did this a couple of days ago, uh, but I wasn't in the warehouse for a few days. So I've got to unmold and, um, and cut these up today. So I, it just, it just struck me. I've got this rolly tape, uh, you know, thing, and I've never actually put curing soap on it. I've just been filling up my tables and running out of space. So I'm like, why don't I just use that? Um, this is the little sample station that I have. It's just on wheels. It's just a little, I don't know if I got this second hand or for free or it was given to me. I can't remember. It's not very well put together. Um, yeah, but I just organize my different soaps, you know, uh, that's some molds that I've got to sell. Um, try to sell them on Facebook marketplace. Um, yeah. And a few days ago I'd had a big tidy up and I've just rearranged some things in the manufacturing area. Um, yeah, now I've got a special place that I can put my dirty soap dishes until I can wash them. This slab cutter just keeps on breaking wires. I don't know what I'm doing wrong, but oh, honestly. Um, yeah, this section over here was getting just a little bit too messy and a bit too big, so I've just condensed it down. Now I've just got the essentials, um, soap books, and oh yeah, I'm going to show you my GMP. So this is where I just write down when I've received something and when I open it, um, different materials, oils and butters and lye and all that kind of stuff. And if you're not already doing this, you should be because for GMP, it's really handy, but it's also great to see if you're buying within a good amount of time. Um, obviously you don't want to be holding on to supplies for too long, but of course we're also mid slash post pandemic. Um, you know, so like sometimes you have to buy more than you necessarily, you know, would want to. And you can also notice when you've got like peak making periods, uh, labels, um, recipes that I use regularly over and over again. I'd have, uh, what's the word? Laminated. <laughs> what, a, what a morning, honestly, I think I need more coffee. 
yeah, so this is all set up. It's very, very convenient to make at. I wish the PowerPoints were in different places, though. That's hard to work with. Um, oh, yeah, there's my lunchbox. I was looking for that <laughs> that morning. So handy. Just leave it in the warehouse. Nice one. Uh, yeah, so my lovely big girl, Nelta. I'm only halfway through filling this up with demineralized water. It's honestly taking so much. I think I bought 12 bottles and it still wasn't enough. Um, yeah, and when you're filling, make sure that you've always got something to cover up that funnel because if you accidentally get some oil in there, you are going to mess up your melter and that is not good. Um, yeah, organized chaos. Let's just like make our mess neat, hey? Uh, and this contact paper, I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's the heat. It's beginning to, you know, warp a little bit and pull back, but it's still, still keeping the... The table clean, so that's great. Ah, wonderful photographer. Um, I'll put her details in the show notes. I, yeah, got some fantastic prints from her. I just need someone to help me hang them up because weirdly enough, this is like hardwood. I can't hammer in the nails. Uh, I got this cool display unit thing for only 29 bucks from a charity shop. I'm in love with it. Um, let's see. I got some carry bags for the market. Um, they came in these you know bubble wrap bags uh to keep them protected in transit it's cool i'm going to reuse them they're going to be fantastic for stuff that i you know tend to resell if i sell things on marketplace or whatever i've had to pilfer some stuff from this shelf because i was getting a tiny bit low until some things cured but this is how the showroom's looking at the moment um yeah i'm having trouble fitting everything in so i'm glad that i've got that other unit I'm not sure if I'll stain it or just leave it as it is. And this cool pot, this plant stand, I'm going to put some jade in there. Uh, it's going to look absolutely beautiful. So, yeah, this is kind of how the warehouse is at the moment. Yeah, the jade will get lots of nice light through there. And jade is called money plant too. So, you know, let's, let's see it bringing all the prosperity to me. All the prosperity, <laughs> please. <laughs> um, yeah, so this is where we're at. I'd better go back to planning for this market. See you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.